One thing a lot of people struggle with is feeding with a catapult while holding the pole. To show a very simple way how I do it, but hopefully you'll be able to replicate and find just as easy. The main thing to do is set up the pole and your box so everything's coming across your knees and your knees are flat. Because this actually takes a lot of the weight and enables you to feed with a catapult quite easily. So you see, I'm in a spot now where I'm fishing. My knees are taking a lot of the weight of the pole and I'm just supporting it with my forearm. When I hold it there, I've got both hands free now to do whatever I want. All right. So from there, all I do, my side tray is on my left hand side. That way I can reach down, I'm not reaching across if it was on the opposite side. So it's on my left hand side, I can pick my catapult up and also at the same time, I can pick up my bait while I'm feeding, which in this case is just two or three pellets. There, I can hold a pouch with one hand because both hands are free. I can still watch my float and I can use my knee, if I get a bite, to strike. There. So I'm all in control of my float, I'm in control of my pole, but I've still got the catapult. Put the pellets in the pouch, there. Using my back hand, which is free, I hold the pouch, and then I don't pull the pouch back, I push the catapult forwards. So from there, all I'll do is push the catapult forwards, and at the same time release the pouch. And there it am. Nice and easy feeding. It's that simple. If it's a little bit windy, you can always support it a little bit with a couple of fingers. And that still gives you the freedom to feed constantly. So if you're fishing shallow, especially in summer, you can just be feeding all the time, pinging pellets out, lay your rig in. Again, you can feed some more pellets. That's so all the time you're feeding and working, but you've got both hands free just by a correct position in your box, just making sure your pole's supported by your knee. Really easy to do, really simple.